Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a reveal video for you guys and I would have to kind of say it's a collective haul. I received these items. Um, I have three of them and I received them in the last couple of months. One of them being for Mother's Day, the other one being for my birthday, and the other one being for Christmas of 2017. These were all gifts from hubby and I think he did really well. Um, and picking these out for me because I absolutely love these items and I wanted to share these with you because I do have a few tips just in case you guys are interested in uh, wanting to get into this brand. This brand is not as known, I realize, it's not as known as um, like the bigger brands like Cartier, Rolex, but it is fine jewelry. I absolutely love the brand. I really like how dainty it is and I've been getting a lot, a lot of compliments. So I wanted to share these items with you and like I mentioned, I wanted to give you guys a little bit of tips that I learned through the process of, you know, going to the store and kind of checking them out and trying them on and all of that. So yeah, let's get started. Also, if you are new to my channel, hi, my name is Gina. I really hope you enjoy this video. And if you really like this video or you found it helpful, I would love for you to consider subscribing to my channel for future videos. I wanted to mention that I am a mom of three and before I really liked putting on a lot of um, fashion jewelry, I would have to say, and I, I used to really enjoy them. But when I became a mom, I really felt like I didn't have the time or the energy to kind of put on and off all my jewelry. I really still enjoy wearing jewelry, but I decided to go on to the fine jewelry just because it's so convenient. I don't have to really take it on and off and, you know, especially when I'm showering and all of that. So I actually did wear these, you know, all my jewelry the day I got them. As soon as I got them, I just, re I just put it on and I haven't taken them off. The only time that I did take them off is when I gave birth to my third son and um, which was only like five, six months ago. And I took them off right now just so I can show you guys how it all came. So I kind of reboxed it up so you guys kind of get an idea of what it should look like or whatnot if you are interested in purchasing these items. I'm gonna start off with my older piece and then I'm gonna kind of work my way up to the newer piece that I received not that long ago. But this one's actually not that old. I received this in May for Mother's Day from my husband. And this is what the bag looks like. It just says Van Cleef and Arpel. And on the other side, it says VCA. I usually just say VCA or I just say Van Cleef just because I feel like the name is so long. But anyway, I, I think that's how you say it, Van Cleef and Arpel right anyway uh, so this is what it looks like and it comes with a receipt that looks like so in the back and it also comes with this folder looking thing I actually don't even know what's in here let me open it up with you guys So, oh, so this is, it comes with um, the authenticity of certificate and that's where they write your, uh, what is it, like the serial number. So all the jewelry pieces have its own serial number and it's actually engraved on all the pieces. So that's actually quite nice. And it also comes with, oh, a little description of um, the type of, jewelry that I received and here is the ribbon obviously I didn't put the ribbon back but it's just green very thick material I must say that the quality of the things that they use is actually really good it's really thick and I'm all about packaging and it's just very sturdy this is the box that it came with and it's just very sturdy and that's what it looks like and then it's, it says VCA embossed right here in silver and it's this um, velvety type of material. And I'm sure you guys have seen this in either some of my videos or my Instagram because I, like I mentioned, I like never took it off. But this is what I received. 
This is the Sweet Alhambra bracelet in the carnelian. Carnelian? Carnelian? Yes, yeah, so that's the name of the stone. It's a carnelian stone. And that's what I was talking about when I had received um, in, in here in this little pamphlet booklet. And it just kind of talks about the stone and all of that. Yeah, it just talks about like the history and the care advice and so that was pretty neat. But this is what I received and it's just super, super dainty. I have gotten so many compliments on this bracelet. At first I didn't really think that a lot of people would notice but because it's just so small but it's just apparently like it's just no joke how many compliments I got on this bracelet. And this one, like I mentioned, it is in the Sweet Alhambra collection. This one only has one clover, and I believe that... I'm not sure if the Sweet Alhambra actually... I believe it also comes with like a three clover, but I think that's on the vintage Alhambra line, which is, you know, the clovers are like... They're like a lot bigger. I think they're like about that big. But... And so I this is what I received and the tip on this is, you know, as I was checking them out because what the essay does is, you know, once you choose the bracelet, she'll kind of go to the back and she brings out whatever she has in inventory and you get to look at all of them and you actually get to pick which one you want. Like I mentioned earlier, each, each bracelet has its own serial number, which is also written in your invoice and also in the authenticity card. And I noticed that for the carnelian, mine is more of like a darker, deep, almost burgundy color. And that's kind of the look that I wanted, but not all the reds are the same. You have like the little brighter reds and you also have like the deeper reds like this one. So in the case that, let's say you wanna go and get like a matching necklace or a matching you know, earring sets, then it would be helpful that you bring your actual bracelet so you're able to kind of match the same red, if you know what I mean, because it's all kind of, they're all different shades. So that's a tip that I wanted to share with you guys. And also don't forget to ask for a little to-go um, traveling uh, little pouch because I feel like these are so helpful. It's also really good quality. And I don't, I think she gave me, the essay that helped me with this purchase, she was actually pretty new. So I, most likely, most definitely actually, she gave me the wrong pouch because I don't think this is the pouch for the bracelets. So yeah, but I mean, it works either way. I, I'm not gonna go back and, you know, ask for it. But yeah, that's what that looks like. And the service at Van Cleef is actually really great, especially when they see that you're pretty serious about wanting to buy a piece or you're actually, you know, interested in in the pieces. They come and they offer you the usual water or, you know, coffee and whatnot. And they offered us also chocolates, which were really, really good. They come straight from France and you know, my husband kept asking for more because it was so good and I wish I still had the box, but like it was like a really cute, sturdy box. It kind of looked like a mini Godiva chocolate set. It came with two chocolates. It was super good. And I had also gone with my kids that day. And so they offered my kids this, which is actually pretty cool. And it says Van Cleef and Arpels. And it's just, you know, a set of crayons, which I thought it was pretty neat. I don't know if any of the others, I'm not very familiar with, you know, like for instance, Tiffany or Cartier or Rolex doing, um, having crayons and stuff like that for you, for the kids. At least I haven't been offered for my kids. And they also offer you like a, like a booklet for them to color. It's like a coloring book, but this one's not the actual there is cause I got an extra one. And so this one was kind of untouched and the other one is just colored all over but it was actually pretty neat and it also comes with stickers and I don't know I just thought you know if you ever go there these are stickers if you guys ever go there with your kids or whatnot you or if, even if you have kids at home you could always request one and it has like you know little projects and I thought it was really cool and so I wanted to share that with you so this is what it looks like on and it's super small but it's dainty and it's just 
it's so cute like I mentioned I got so many compliments on it and so you guys can see it's in this it's in the first setting because my wrists are kind of small and you have this piece hanging but it doesn't really bother me I think you can choose to actually take it off if you don't like it dangling but it doesn't really bother me I really like it that way and then you have the, authentic the authenticity number on this little bar right here and yeah so that's what it looks like the next item came in a slightly bigger bag and it's the same thing it says BCA on one side and Van Cleef and Arpel on the other side and the same thing with the same um, receipt holder but it was a little different uh, this time around I got it in like a little cardboard um, booklet that opens up like so and I got this as a birthday gift in September and you have the care services booklet and the authenticity so I really like this layout better than the other one so maybe they switched it up from you know anywhere between May and September I'm not sure but that's what it looks like in the front and that's what it looks like in the back and it has like a BCA on there oops here is the box it came in same thing, same box. And my husband decided to get me the sweet Alhambra again, but this is in the Mother of Pearl. So it's super, super cute. I love it. And this one's actually in the um, gold as you know the carnelian only comes in the rose gold so you don't get to really choose the stone and the color of the hardware is it hardware do they call it hardware but anyway yeah so you don't get to choose like the stone and the color of your you know the material that you want whether it's gold rose gold white gold whatnot so the mother of pearl only comes in the yellow gold and the carnelian only comes in the rose gold which is perfect because you know, I, I usually stack, well, I only, I always stack these two together and I love the fact that I have the two different uh, types of gold on my, on my braid, on my wrist. So that's what it looks like. And I also got this one, which is the travel uh, pouch. And that's what I, I had mentioned that the other one was the wrong one that they put for me because this actually seems more fitting you put the bracelets you lay it down flat and the long way and it kind of clicks in these two little tabs so this travel pouch is actually very convenient even though I like I mentioned I don't take them off but it's just you know just in case you never know so I'm gonna try this on for you guys so you guys get an idea of what it looks like stacked so this is what it looks stacked and I actually love this look I love the yellow gold with the rose gold and the two different colors and it's just you know it's this is just the bracelet I never take it off I can't stop saying that but it's just so convenient I love it my kids love it they actually love you know they love they love looking at it and kind of saying flower and what color it is and all of that but uh, I wanted to mention this is also in the small setting and the details on it is like I mentioned earlier they both have the authenticity number on the little bar but on the little hook right here I'm gonna probably show a close-up picture but uh, there's actually like a VC engraved VCA engraving on there it just kind of looks exactly like this but it's on the hardware and I just love the little details that show you know um, if you look at the close-up of the bracelets it's just it's it's a lot of work um, that you can see through the bracelets the tip that I have for the mother of pearl is that you know when I when she brought them all out and I wanted to like you know she had me inspect and pick the one that I wanted I noticed that a lot of the mother of pearl bracelets if you see mine I well I prefer to get like the straight flat surface but because it is like natural pearl not all of them have like that flat surface look so a lot of the clovers that I did see with the mother of pearl they had like little imperfections like little bumps and you know like just how you would think of a pearl so it has like little it had like little bumps and it just wasn't solid flat 
Um, I wanted to mention that it's both sides. It's a pearl and same with a carnelian. It's just a little see-through, but it's just that one stone. But it was just very, it was kind of difficult to find like the perfect solid, uh, solid pearl on both sides. So, you know, I maybe it's just my preference that I wanted it to be solid. Or, you know, if you like that more of a natural look, then you might want to you know aim to get like more of a bumpier look and so also I wanted to go over with the receipt with you guys on this purchase as well this is called the Suida Hambra bracelet yellow gold white mother of pearl and they also have my uh, serial number on there and this one is actually 1250 so the mother of pearl is $50 more inexpensive than the carnelian just for reference and I believe all the flat um all the jewelry just because it's like the same style but a different stone it doesn't make it the same price uh Ben Khalifa and Arpels if you go in you'll see like a bunch of different stones they have like the onyx um they have diamonds just you know like the whole clover is filled with diamonds or just straight all of it is white gold with no stones and the prices all vary so you might have to look into you know the price differences and all of that final item that i received came in this bigger bag and i don't know why i received it in such a big bag oh actually i do know why they they probably gave me a big bag because i had the coloring books that i received they gave me extra coloring books and they just kind of put it in there so that's why i got a bigger bag but same thing from VCA and on the other side Van Cleef and Arpel. And I have the the invoice or the receipt and this time around it's also the trifold um, authenticity and card card care advice services or you know the instructions on how to care for your jewelry and the ribbon and I got the travel kit right here and this one's actually a lot bigger than the little small one that I showed you for my carnelian and here is uh, the box it's the same size box and this I also wear all the time with the exception of today and I received this for Christmas to reveal oh oh this is what I received and this is um, a pair of earrings is also from the sweet Alhambra collection which is smaller than the vintage Alhambra which like I mentioned earlier it's a lot bigger a lot of people actually wear the bigger ones but I actually like the smaller ones better just because you know, I'm gonna, you know, I knew I was gonna wear them every day and with my kids pulling on my earring on my ears and my earrings and all of that, I just wanted something small and simple. And it also comes with this little cloth on top, and this is what you use to clean the stones. But I don't know why this only came with the earrings and not with the bracelets. But I love these earrings, it's super cute. And I love the fact that they're black. With this one, actually, there is, you know, they all look identical. When she took them out, they just all look identical. There is nothing really to look for. They're all the same black color and they're all solid, no bumps. So it's actually easier to, you know, there's nothing really much to pick from. I really like the back. I'm going to show a close up, but I really like the way the back looks because that little um, bar doesn't, doesn't, if you guys look at it from the side, there's nothing sticking out of the bar. And so therefore, when I'm holding my when I'm holding my baby or my kids or whatnot, sometimes, you know, their their head kind of rubs across my ear and I'm always scared that I'm going to scratch his face, but because there is nothing sharp coming out of the back of my earring, it just kind of, you know, it makes me very comfortable that I'm able to wear these earrings. And once again, I never take these off either. So I'm gonna try these on for you guys. So this is what it looks like. And as you guys can see, it's really small. The vintage Alhambra is a little bigger and it kind of comes out of your earlobe. And I just didn't want something so big, especially because I find it 
I find those a little more like a formal setting and I wanted something more casual that I can wear every day. But this is just perfect. So it's just really small and dainty. I'm going to go over uh, the receipt to give you guys the information. And this is the Sweet Alhambra Ear Studs, yellow gold. Oh, so I forgot to mention these are in the yellow gold. So it's yellow gold onyx. And then it has the reference number. And these are $2,300 plus tax. So it's $2,300 plus tax. And as mentioned earlier in the video, um, I'm going to put all the links of, you know, the stuff that I that I showed you guys down in the description box below. So depending on when you watch the video, you might wanna check the links below to make sure there was no price increases. All in all, the Van Cleef stores, the customer service was great. Like I mentioned, uh, the first time around, it was one essay and she ended up leaving. So we ended up switching essays and for the other two items, we used that same essay or salesperson and the customer service was great we we got you know the same service all three times you know they offered us something to drink they offered our kids juice or milk and a coloring book pencils they offered my husband chocolates and it was just the customer service was great they're very patient so i really like that i really like it when you walk in and they make you feel welcomed and not rushed and so yeah, I, I'm really looking forward to adding more pieces to my collection, most definitely. Right now, I'm only eyeing the, the, the clovers for some reason. I just, I really love the clovers, but they also have like butterflies and they have hearts and they have all these different kind of stones. But, but that's all I have for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and or found it helpful. If you guys have any more questions or comments, please leave them down below. And as mentioned early in the video, if you are new to my channel, I would love for you to consider subscribing if you enjoyed this video or found it helpful. And I'll see you guys on my next one. Bye.